Oh yeah. Ooh, 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 we're back. Hungover. Freaking wild night. Yeah. Let's jump into some Russ. Recipe for disaster. Yeah, how we going, boys? Welcome. Solo. You know, you know, you know it. About 24 hours late to this one. Server still pops. Let's go. So much damage to me, man. What a waste of my time. No, oh, why is there never any bloody cloth anywhere, man? It's always a, such a cloth shortage on Rust these days. Especially when you're starting out fresh. When you like a little bit later into wipe, it's bloody everywhere. It's always the starting out in Rust. It's always a slog. Once you can get that base down and get a couple of. Uh, Couple of bows behind your belt, you're fine. Yoink. Kinda gotta take what you can get your hands on when you can get your hands on it. Oh, that's actually really good. It's a hundred metal frags there if I can recycle it. Notes on that hill. We might have to live in the snow this wipe, I don't know. I'm gonna drop a bag around the outpost here so at least we've got a good starting spot whenever we want to rejoin in. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be alright I think. Oh there's a fucking guy farming down there. Later sucker. Hey hey guy. Right I need to find a fucking campfire or something because I'm gonna freeze my titties off out here. Minus twenty-four. <laughs> right, I'll just camp here. We'll do the rest come the morning I guess. Yes, excellent. Right, we'll wait here for day. Do you want to trade? <clears throat> yeah, what do you need? I, I only give you some cloth for some wood. Uh, yeah, how much? I need wood. Oh, yeah, how much? I've only got like 700. You give me 500? Yep. Or, give me 500 for 100 cloth, okay? Yeah, deal. Thanks, buddy. Okay, thanks, man. Have a great day. That is actually really freaking good. I really needed cloth as well. I know, like, we, we need the wood too, but I did just buy that wood for 150 stone. Well freaking worth. Right, let's go get a little bit more cloth by the looks things over here. Oh, I, oh, this side doesn't look as fun as the other. There's some big bases I don't like the look of. I might have to go around the other side. That ain't good, that ain't good, that ain't good. Gonna have to do that. Sucks, but it's gotta be done. Not a tip top base, but it is only our starter. We just needed to get something down. I don't think you can build those in anything anymore, which sucks. Okay, 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 okay. That'll have to do. Best thing is, though, as well, we've got this nice little area where we can actually grow a little bit of hemp, which is quite nice, actually. Roof camper. Stunning. Right, with the base secure now, I've stoned up that ceiling. The big play is scrap. We need that workbench level one. Oh, and we're going to need low grade for furnace as well. Sugar. Okay, so we're going to need to go get scrap because I can buy low grade at the outpost with that. I'm going to take a trip over to a cave I saw on my way over here. See, well, maybe there might be some low grade kicking about either in it or around it. Yeah, all is well in the world. Fuck, this guy's gonna get to the outpost. A few recyclables there, that makes that makes me happy. Yeah, that's hot. That's hot. Let's get a crossy as well. Oh, then we'll go home and uh, craft the tier one at home, I guess. Yep, progression. You gotta. Why am I dragging things? And they just ain't dragging. You gotta love it. Right. 
We are good. We are golden right now. Tier 1 workbench up. Should probably do something about that gap, but I'd like to think we'd be okay. This is good. This is well. We are fine. So furnace is down. We're all cooking on gas right now. I need to get a little bit more wood so I can craft myself a headpiece and a body chest plate thingy majig. Wood chest plate. So we'll grab some wood for that. We need to get an airlock on this. Pretty damn sharpish as well, actually. But everything's looking good. Everything's coming up Millhouse right now. I do not like the look of that one bit. I think that man has a gun. In fact, I'm pretty sure he does. Maybe not. Are you kidding? There was a bear trap in that bush. Most unlucky thing to ever happen to me. 2k18, I don't know. Hit him again. He lives in that base. Pretty sure of it. My man had a revy and a rad suit and I would have loved that. That fucking bear trap. Oh, hello. Ah. Didn't go in. Did you just take a horse and run off? Oh, the fucking Eoka, man. I fucked it. Oh, oh big mistake. All my gear gone. Ah. Oh, my shots felt crisp with that crossy as well. Ah. Minor setback, I suppose, in the grand scheme of things, but at the same time, so annoying. Damn it, man. I think I was right to push, but he got a good shot on me. I went with Ioka. Now, well. Oh, they are fucking well open in the, out in the open. Baby, I just not. I'm not gonna have enough health to get out. Where am I? Out. Oh, it's so far home, and I dumped all my shit. Do I grab my shit? Fuck it. I'll spawn and I'll grab my shit. Oh my god. Let's go. That's so much sulfur. I can do nothing with this sulfur right now until we've got some stuff. Maybe I can bargain trade it, perhaps. That could be the only viable option. Tell you what I need to do, though. I need to destroy my twig so that I can build back in as and when that guy puts his furnaces back on. Let's fucking go. 3.6k cooked fucking sulfur. I love it. Right, that is perfect. So that really helps us out. Gives us enough scrap as well if we want to learn any blueprints. The metal frags are helpful too. Right, so the big thing, I need to go back and grab my stuff. Actually, you can use this lock to lock that, which is very helpful indeed. Um, and we'll just, yeah, we'll just head on back and grab, hopefully, all that stuff next to that sleeping bag I put down. I was expecting to have to spawn out, throw it out through one of the gaps, but no, we did it, boys. And no one is any the wiser. All right. That's a man meddling up his base over there. I don't want to be part of that. His base is massive as well. He's getting ready to do a fucking, uh, do summon. His furnaces are exposed as well. <laughs> oh, 
Wow, that guy's a fucking god. He must have had two crossbows because he could, he reloaded a lot quicker than me. Tidy. Okay, so I think what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to risk it for the chocolate biscuit and take any ogre pistol to the base just over here. I love having this airlock, by the way. I quite like this base as well. We're, we're stacking up on a little bit of loot now. And I like it built into the rock. It's good. Save some resources, all that jazz. But we're obviously in a very, very open area of space. Near the outpost, near a lot of bases. Obviously where we just died as well. But I'm thinking, although he has a code lock on this, which makes me think he's got metal frags. I don't know. We're obviously going to get counted at 100%. But why not? Give it a go. If we die, we die. If I have to come back with, like, machetes or something as well to get in here, I don't mind. This is the only way we're going to get a little bit of loot today. And, uh, yeah. Why not? Oh, I do see a guy. I thought I saw a guy. Watch him shoot me. Here we go. Nice. That door's only got one health. What do we think? Metal door behind here? Oh, it's open. Okay. Let's get a key lock on this. Okay. My friend, finally, a little bit of something we can use. I like it, I like it a lot. It's been a big, long time coming. Not too, like, top grade loot. Dude, you built like a shitty, shitty base here. Not, okay, that's nice. That's nice. That is so nice. That's some good recyclables. Okay, I like it. Anything in the campfire, a bit more wood. You know what? For what we've got, I will bloody take it, because that is so... I don't know. Nah, maybe, maybe a lot of cloth, 85 scrap, this two k, over 2k stone, a rad suit. That was so worth the time and the effort, I think, 100%. I'm going to take this spare furnace as well. I've only just crafted a spare, actually, which sucks. Unnamed bag. Yeah, not bad, dudes, not bad. Those early game raiding styles coming in clutch. Alright dudes, and that amazing little early game raid has brought our day to a close for day one on Rust, and I must say, we are having a good go of it. Look how much loot we've got in the TC, you know. I'm like, for having done like, no real farming, very impressed with that so far. The base needs an expansion. What I want to do next episode is get like, pickaxe blueprint, pick through this wall, make myself like a little bit more space. Maybe pick through this one, I don't know, make it, I'll, I'll turn it into a 2x2. Two two. I kind of like living with this, I just like the rock aesthetic to the whole base. Just feels like, I don't know, cozy, you know? Like, it, I love the sort of things when you can do that, it's great. Anyway, um, but yeah, thank you so freaking much for watching, boys. Next episode will kick on. This is going to come out pretty damn soon um, from when you see it to when I'll be playing next. So drop any base designs you have in the comments down below, um, some videos that you've watched or anything, because I'm, I'm still toying with main base or expanding this one, to be fair. So let me know your thoughts and what you think and uh, what you want to see next episode. But yeah, thank you very much. Don't forget to leave a like if you did enjoy it. Check out some of the other stuff on the channel right here. I've been Tills, and I'll see you next time. Thank you very much, boys. Peace out.